If you're trying to log in or, you know, browse a website using Safari on your iPhone 16 and suddenly you're seeing this error, Safari can't open the page because too many redirects occurred. Well, let's walk through a few simple steps that you can try to fix this issue instantly. Now, this basically happens for stored Safari cache and cookies, some network issues, maybe some minor glitch, incorrect date and time, and if the website you are trying to access is stuck in a redirection loop. So we're going to start with force restarting our device. For that, just quickly press and release the volume up and down button and press and hold the side button till the screen goes black. If this happening for any minor software glitch, a force restart might solve that. Alright, so if that didn't help you, now let's open up Safari, tap on this tab button, and if you see too many tabs are opened up in here, you can just clear it up right from here. You can just go ahead, clear all of them. Now after that, let's open up settings, scroll down for app. We're gonna just clear some app cache and cookie, that's all. Scroll down and find Safari. Scroll down till the end and enter advanced to website data. Tap on remove all website data and then tap on remove now. After that, go back one step and here tap on clear history and website data. Make sure all history is selected and then just tap on clear history. You are still keep having the same problem. You know what? Just open up settings now, go to general, Scroll down for date and time because incorrect date and time might cause this problem. So here, just make sure your date and time is selected to set automatically. All right, guys, so even if that didn't solve your problem, you know, network or Wi-Fi issue play a big part in this. So now what you can do is just go ahead, check your internet connection. Just go ahead, open up any app. Play something that needs Wi-Fi or internet on your device to play, just to make sure your internet is fast and functional. And apart from that, just swipe down your control panel, and from here just tap on aeroplane mode, work for around 10 seconds, and then just turn it off. This will just refresh the network. Alright guys, so if none of this helped you, now, we can fix the network related issues all at once now by reset network settings. So for that, now we're going to open up settings one last time to general. Scroll down for transfer or reset iPhone to reset, to reset network settings. Put down your screen lock password if prompted. This will not delete any data. Just make sure you have your Wi-Fi password because this will erase that. So just tap on reset network settings. And when your iPhone 16 restarts after reset network settings, reconnect with your Wi-Fi or internet. And now just go ahead, open up Safari and use that for a while to see if that solved your problem. Please let us know in the comment section if it does. Thanks for watching.